Anderson University Television. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Anne Marie. I'm Wendy, and we'll be filling in for Proofy today in the Campus Corner. William Patterson University is celebrating Asian culture with two weeks worth of celebrations. That's right, and our crew at Room Report was able to attend some of the events. Of course, we brought back a package of goodies just for you. Let's check it out. Hi, I'm Proofy Pierre with Rumor Report, and here at William Patterson University, we are celebrating Asian celebrations. And today, we are in celebration of Holy High, which means new ideas, new life, and new beginnings. And let's just say, with spring upon us, there's a whole bunch of new life on campus. Henna, Indian food, color fest, and a good time is what took place at the Holy High celebration at William Patterson. I'm in charge of the color station at the Holy Festival. The Holy Festival is a traditional Indian event that welcomes spring and the colors represent new life and new ideas. So this is our first Holy event and it was a huge success. We had Indian food and colors and Holy were like all colored up and all colored. Not only were students able to grab a bite to eat, they were also surrounded by good music that kept the crowd jumping. The event has been pretty good so far. The music is good and it feels good outside, so yeah, it's been good. Asian Celebration Week also included an event on sex education and mental health. My goal today was just to be open about sexual health, any questions, um, and also share with them about mental health and how it has impacted my personal family. It was very interesting because we touched upon topics that we don't usually talk about, uh, especially in an Asian household. The Asian Cultural Celebration Committee for this week put together events that were fun and also informal. The celebration continues with K-pop dance night tonight and more events until Sunday. That's all for Campus Corner News. I'm Pruvi Pierre. You know, Wendy, what I loved about this um, Holy High Festival was that like not only was it educational and informal, but it was also a great time. Like as I was walking up, I got so excited hearing the music, seeing like the colors everywhere. I was like, wow, what is this? This looks great. That does sound like a lot of fun. Like since there was, I heard there was like a color, they were throwing color paintballs or whatever it was around. Oh, no, not Did you get hit balls. like by any chance? Oh no, I, I made it a point to stay away from the colors. Yeah, no, I was not gonna get hit. <laughs> did you get a chance to try some of the food? It did look very oh, delicious. Oh, it was very tasty, super, super good. And the henna art, I thought it was so beautiful. Did you get a chance to get to, to get one or you no? You know what, the line was way too long. I was. I was not willing to wait it, so. It does look like a lot of fun. It was, it did look very exciting. I really wish I was there. It was, and what about your event that you went to? Uh, for my event, we went to the health and wellness. It was like, it focused a lot on sex education and okay. mental health. And I think those topics are very important, although it is very uncomfortable to start off the conversation. I was very surprised to know that like, there was a lot of things even I didn't know about sex education or mental health. and. Yeah. To me, I was glad. To me, like I, I was glad I went. That way, I'm more informed and I can, I could better take care of myself and just know what to do in those yeah. situations. And that's good, you know. That's why I believe I'm proud to be part of William Patterson. Yeah, yeah. yeah like I just feel much safer and well informed now after this event. All right, that's all for this segment of Campus Corner. See you guys next time.